I hope you guys are all having a magnificent day. Easy Auto Fix here, and today we're gonna learn symptoms of a stuck open PCV valve. The purpose of the PCV valve is to recirculate harmful gases from the crankcase into the intake manifold, where it then travels to get burned off in the combustion chamber. This helps to minimize oil sludge, lowers emissions, and reduces moisture. Your PCV valve should be replaced around 50,000 miles. The PCV valve is usually located on the valve cover or near the air intake. Here's the location on a Toyota Camry. And here's the location on a Nissan Sentra. The first symptom of a stuck open PCV valve is having your check engine light on. You might get a P0171 which basically means the air slash fuel ratio has more air than fuel in the combustion process. This code is also correlated to random misfires, so you might get a P0300 code as well. Now you can read these codes by going to the parts store near you, and they'll most likely do it for free. Or you can buy the scanner that I have that's worth it, linked in the description below. Now you can still have a faulty PCV valve with no check engine light, so let's move on to the next symptom. The second symptom is a rough idle. The reason for this is due to a lean condition that's created by a stuck open valve that allows too much air and gases coming from the crankcase into the combustion chamber. In order for an engine to run its best, it always strives to achieve the perfect air slash fuel ratio. A stuck open PCV valve disrupts this ratio. This is why your car has a rough idle. The third symptom could be a stalling engine. In some situations, if there's too much air coming from the crankcase, it's possible to have your engine turn off due to poor combustion efficiency. The fourth symptom is increased oil consumption. Maybe you're noticing you're frequently low on oil and having to put another quart just to keep it at the right level. The reason for this could be due to a stuck open valve allowing vapors and unwanted oil to be sucked out of the crankcase and into the combustion chamber where it gets burned off in the process. This in which creates the fifth symptom, blue smoke coming out from the exhaust. Since the combustion chamber is burning oil coming from the stuck open PCV, it will produce blue smoke that will exit out of the exhaust valve and out of the tailpipe. A quick tip to help you determine if your PCV valve is bad is by removing it and performing the rattle test. If you shake the PCV valve and it doesn't rattle, then it's time for a new one. With that said, thank you guys for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe so I can see you in the next video.